Welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue. Quite a sight to behold. Well, there are plenty looking forward to seeing this. A capacity crowd here. Yes, Peter. It's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. So that's got things on the way. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, Peter. It's his pace that's his main attribute especially over those first few yards where he just seems to glide away from defenders, gets himself into great positions and likes to hit it hard and nice and early. That's a horrible combination for any defence that's trying to deal with him. I can tell you that. Hard well, to disagree with that. It is the sort of situation he thrives in. De Bruyne, De Bruyne with a long pass. Granit Xhaka. Now it's Aubameyang. Gets wrestled off the ball. Gundogan, Aguero, De Bruyne. Has a pop! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Manchester City know they can rely on the counter and they've just expressed a warning. Gundogan. De Bruyne clips one through. And that has been cleared. Arsenal have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Laporte. Forward it goes. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. David Luiz. Neither side yet able to find the net. Caballos. Tries to get it forward quickly. De Bruyne. And it's De Bruyne. Aguero. Aguero showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. Looks to clip it forward. Bernardo Silva. Kyle Walker. Aguero. Aguero! And he's there to make a great save. Aguero sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. And a header! I can't speak highly enough of the keeper after that save. Can't stop thinking about it. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Sinchenko drives it forward. And he's cut it out. 
A slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome there. Manchester City just had to make the ball stick, but came up short. De Bruyne. And here's Aguero. It's a shapes to shoot! Oh, they did so well to set it up. Aguero very sharply moved into position, a given go without end product, unfortunately. Kyle Walker. Bernardo Silva drives it forward. De Bruyne. De Bruyne hits that long. Caballos. Now it's William. Ruben Diaz tries to dink it in. Leno catches it safely. Aubameyang looks to get on the end of this. And the referee brings the first half to a close. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. Would you review the first half? Unspectacular, but solid, and that solidity could yet be the foundation for them to, to go on and win. Interesting half, just missing goals, so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. And we're already back on the way here. Manchester City clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Two others were maybe a tad slow at restarting this game and up steps a big character who was simply switched on and bright and he sparked another advantage for his team at an important stage. It all goes well. Manchester City are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. And Bernardo Silva! He's got away with one there. No, no way through there. Played out to the right. Aguero plays it through. Sterling. That is terrific skill. Good run. Ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Gundogan. And it's to Brock. Good take, and he's had a look. He's had a go! Well, that's a foul. Which side of the line is that? And the referee has given a free kick just outside the box. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score, and obviously he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? Cleared away. Gundogan. De Bruyne, who does have an assist to his name. Now it's Obamia. And back to base. 
Arsenal are definitely going about this the right way. Jim, there's not. He's had a shot! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Played it short. More than happy to take the muscular approach. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. And that's been one straight back. And it's Sterling. He's pinged one through here. It could be a hits one! Manchester City really are enduring a, a frustrating spell when it comes... Hits one! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Well, the work rate to win the ball back was fantastic and it set up the opportunity. That's great effort. Great leap! No, he didn't quite meet it right. William, he's played him through. Bernardo Silva, the only goal came in the early moments of the second period, and the score is 1-0. Nice touch. Bernardo Silva, and the finish! Arsenal have turned to their bench, and we're going to shake for an overhead. Oh, and that should have been two. He got too ahead of himself there, thinking how he could have made things safe. There could be another change here. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. And it's got through. And he's there to clear it. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Looks to thread it through. Oh, he's made sure that that won't get through. Caballos. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Now it's Lacazette. It is just a question of running down the clock now. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Chance! Yeah! It's Two to the good! They have breathing space! That is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. Two up and very little time left. Surely this is it. Yeah, looks very much like the final nail in the coffin for me, I have to say. He's got through. He's away. Goes for goal! And it's there! And the lead is three. It is surely done. And how about the timing of the pass and run? They've worked it before and no doubt they'll work it again.
three. So that's it. It is all over. Oh, great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it. Would you summarise what we've seen today, then, Jim? What I most admire about this outfit.